Rocher, a value update. Um, so I'm in, in Pittsburgh um, watching David graduate. He graduated yesterday and um, I thought I would do an update because I haven't really been completely on track as far as food. That was one of my biggest like things, like stay on track as far as food. And that and I figured if I was gonna do anything, like make any mistakes or fall off, it would be with food. The only thing I took with me was rice cakes, protein bars, and I brought some crystal light as well. And so I kind of figured I would just kind of nibble on that if I was hungry or anything like that. So we went to the gym, so I did get a workout in on Friday. We went to Subway, so I felt like that was a good choice. I did Subway. I got a wrap, like a chicken salad wrap. And um, then David had, um, his, um, his dad had a, a, like a cookout type of deal. And I tried to just stick more so with protein, is, which is what I did. So I didn't have any, um, I didn't have any bread or anything like that. Um, I did have a little bit of potato salad, but for the most part I had like just meat. So I thought I did okay with that. Um, that was what, Friday night? And then Saturday we went to Subway again. Um, we had, we made breakfast Saturday morning. We had Subway again for lunch. And then dinner, we went to this, um, what is it called? I can't think of the name of the, it's like a gas station type convenience store where you can order stuff there. And oh my gosh, y'all, I had a cheeseburger with fries and it was so freaking good. <laughs> it was so freaking good. I don't know how many calories it probably was. And so, um, yeah, that's what I had. That was last night and it was late. It was like. It had to be like 11 o'clock. Um, came home, knocked out. Um, but we did walk yesterday too, though, Saturday. We did walk yesterday too. And then we walked again today. But it was kind of rainy today. My feet were so cold. But we did go for a walk today. Yesterday we did pretty good. Yesterday we went to the outlet mall as well. And so we walked a lot. I think yesterday I was at like something crazy let me see let me see if my um i don't even know if my app has been working i mean my watch is working but i don't know if my um, app is working yesterday was fourteen thousand steps so yesterday we did really good that was yesterday and then today so far we're at 4300 and it is, I didn't change the time on my clock, 8, 19, 11. So it's 11.39. I kept California time. And so, yeah, that's where we're at right now. And then tomorrow we'll be back probably around, I think we land at like 8.39. I feel good that I'm at least still staying active. Again, my diet hasn't been exactly like the greatest. Um, but same time again I'm just trying to just enjoy this time and then once I get back home your girl will be back back on track. you guys I have been back for like a week tomorrow and I wanted to do an outro for this video for you guys the trip back was amazing it was so short that was only four days not even four full days but um but um, for those of you who have watched me for a long time, y'all remember David Papas. Y'all remember him in the, in the background and the videos bouncing around. Always wanting to be in the video and do what mommy was doing. And um, I think I started the channel when he was like three. He was like, yeah, I want to say he was three. So a lot of you guys remember him. And so I wanted to throw in a clip of him graduating for those of you who have followed me for a long time. And you're like virtual aunt, aunts and uncles in a way. And so I'm going to post up a clip right here.
but we had a freaking awesome time. I'm so proud of him, you guys. Like, I can't even believe that he graduated already. I'm just like, wow, what is next? Um, but we had an awesome trip, you guys. And so I want to make this clip really quick. Before I went, I did weigh myself. I really wanted to do my best to stay on track. I wanted to make sure that my diet stayed where it needed to be, that I was working out. So I found out they had a Planet Fitness out there, but it's literally like four minutes away from the, the B&B. So it was like... 40 minutes there, 40 minutes back was just not worth, it wasn't worth it. And so we only went Friday and we actually went before we checked in. And so, um, that was the only day that we went to, to the gym. Like that was the only day. And then, um, on Saturday and Sunday, we walked the neighborhood. I was able to stay active. My diet wasn't exactly where it should have been, but at the same time, I'm not disappointed. Like I, I feel like I did what I did and I enjoyed it, you know what I mean? And then I came back and we're back to the regularly scheduled program, right? Um, and so I, I weighed myself before I went and I weighed myself when I came back and I did gain almost two pounds. I want to say it was like 1.8 pounds. And so I didn't gain mad crazy weight, but yeah. And as of now, I am back down to 144, which is good. Um, what else? You guys, like literally, like listen, listen, listen. So I have these shorts, they're Rockin' Republic shorts, they're size four. And yesterday I was digging through, cause y'all know I'm in SoCal. And you know I'm in the high desert too, and so it gets triple digits here. So yesterday was pretty hot. Actually, no, I take that back. It wasn't super duper hot yesterday. But anyways, listen. So I'm digging through my door and I and I see these shorts, and I haven't worn these shorts, mind you, in forever. Forever. Okay. And so I'm just like, dang, should I try them on? Like, what if I can't fit them? And so, um, I'm just like, okay, whatever, we're going to try them on. So I tried them on and I convinced them, you guys. I was like, ah! <laughs> I was so excited. I was so freaking excited. They're like knee length shorts. And I could totally fit them, you guys. They're size four. And so I was super stoked. I was sporting those yesterday, prancing around, just feeling myself, like totally feeling myself. And so I do have a size, I want to say, ask, do I have a size? I think I have a size two rock and roll jeans and I have a size four. So I'm going to try today and see how they fit in. Y'all know I used to be a size two and I've held on to these damn jeans because they're kind of like in the back of my head. They're kind of been like my goal jeans. Like, let's see if I can get back to these. And it's, I just, I have found through these years, cause y'all it's been years, like Josiah is gonna be nine in October. It's probably it's been years, years since I've worn these jeans, and I and I just haven't been able to part with them. And so I'm gonna try them today and see how I feel. And maybe I'll post it in my next video for you guys. But yeah, your girl has been feeling herself. Um, let me see. I did what did I do today. I did shoulders and arms, shoulders and back today. I did biceps yesterday, and my biceps have been feeling really sore lately, but I do feel like there's definitely growth there. Look at that. Ooh, bicep. Bicep. Bad. All right. Um, this is where we're at now. They're a little sore. Now, what I did differently is, because when I went to the gym yesterday, today is Sunday. When I went to yesterday, which is Saturday, um, because that's usually the day before Sunday. And so when I went yesterday, there was, uh, it was really busy where I usually work out with the cables. And so I decided to do biceps first. So I did, um, biceps. I did three exercises. I did bicep curls with, um, a 50 easy bar. Now, initially I was going to do 40 because I was just like, I haven't been lifting. I don't know. I don't know if I, my strength is there. And so I was going to grab a 40, but there was no 40 there. Somebody was using the 40 and I think they, I think they had the 40 and the 30. And, um, I was like, okay, I'm just going to try the 50 and see how I do. And I did, I did good. Like, I, I don't know. I, I was thinking that my strength would be lower, but my strength was really good. I did four sets of 10 reps. I do hammer curls with a 20 dumbbell. And then I do, um, hammer curls up to where you twist at the top for 15 pounds. And I usually will max that out because it's kind of light. Um, and so I did four sets of that. And then once the cable section where I work out at was open, I did my triceps over there. And so doing 
the biceps and triceps separate, which is what I don't normally do. I normally do my two rotations and both rotations um, incorporate both triceps and biceps. I don't split them, but I did this time and I really feel like I felt it more so in my biceps. Um, and so today my biceps are still a little sore from, and I assume it's from that, from me splitting it like that. I don't know if it's because I'm, you know, concentrating more so on each you know muscle independently I don't know and so I'm probably gonna just continue doing that in the future and just see how it feels for me I feel freaking awesome like I am like feeling myself um I cleaned the garage yesterday and so um I'm probably gonna be because it's gonna start getting super duper hot and I'm not trying to walk the neighborhood in this hot ass California sun SoCal sun Victor Valley Sun. Um, so I'm gonna start using the treadmill in the garage. And so I cleaned up the garage yesterday. It took me like probably almost three hours, but I got it done. Um, and so yeah, we'll be doing that. And so other than that, you guys, I didn't want to make this video super duper long, but I did record some more workout today. Um, Sundays and Saturdays, Saturdays and Sundays are the best days to record because there's almost nobody in there. And so I will throw in some of my workout from today. Other than that, I really appreciate you guys still watching me. And I will see you guys in the next update. Bye, guys. Thank you.